safety issues in daycare centers. Entering the center, plugs in the wall outlets, make sure that uh, if there's an outlet open, that there's a safety plug inserted, and that there are no loose hanging wires, and on the blinds that there's no uh, hanging uh, blind cords for the child to get entangled in, and that um, uh, there's a fire alarm, and we have a monthly uh, fire drill, and that the doors uh, are locked after uh, entering for the safety and the security of the children, and that the, the uh, locks on the gates, make sure that they uh, aren't left unlocked. The, the fencing uh, must meet the ground. No matter if there's a little valley or a hole, that must be filled in so that the ground meets the bottom of the fence and that um, the fencing is secure all the way around the playground and there's no hazardous uh, obstacles on the fence around it and that the playground equipment is uh, well supervised if there's any damage or broken uh, items, uh, make sure that they are fixed immediately, not put off for another day because the safety of the children is vital and we must protect them at every turn of the center inside and out so that there is no, no chance of them having an accident on something that could have been prevented. And also that um, they're uh, dressed safely for the uh, ailments. If there's um, uh, rain or wind or cold, because this is a safety feature as well as a health feature for the children and the environment. And also, backing up to the uh, indoor uh, safety, the furniture must be arranged so that there's no obstacle, no uh, sharp pointed corners for the child to run into, and also the, um, the tables, the, the chairs have to be uh, safety uh, measured for the child's comfort. Uh, 